Hi guys, so let's learn Mad World by Tears for Fears. And the entire songs on the, you could say E flat major scale, but actually due to the way the chords are aligned in the song, you could say the F Dorian, which is a mode of the E flat major scale. So a Dorian scale is generally the second degree or the second mode from any major scale. So it borrows the same notes and also the same chords from that parent major scale. So if you take E flat major, three flats, right? E flat, F, G, A flat, B flat, C, D, E flat. And F Dorian will be born from the F or the second note of the E flat scale. So you go... And the first chord itself of the song Mad World is F minor. So it's on the 2 minor. So it's very, it's a very Dorian sound. Okay. And just to make the Dorian sound sound very unique, you definitely have the 6 natural as well as the 3 flat. So if I build F Dorian now, you'll have F, G, A flat which is the flat 3, normal 4, B flat, normal 5, C. That's a major 6th. So normally in a minor scale you will be like... But that makes it a natural minor, right? To make it Dorian, you do the 6th natural. And you need to use that a bit in the song, which, which is what happens. Back to... E flat which is the 7 flat so to form F Dorian all you need to know is E flat major starting from the second mode and the chords of the scale remain the same you'll have E flat A flat and B flat being the major chords E flat A flat B flat and you'll have F minor G minor and C minor being the minor chords F minor G minor and C minor and then the diminished, which is D diminished, if ever you use, right? So let's get into each section of the song. There are in total four sections, but actually two unique chord progressions. So once you learn both the unique chord progressions, we'll also do the guitar and the piano hook, which happens a lot in the song, the intro, the outro and everywhere else, right? So let's get started. So you have, first of all, the verse I'm going to talk about. Me okay, what happens there? F minor. A flat major. E flat major. B flat major. And that repeats into four. And there's a nice style you can play it on. You can just do it left hand, right hand. Left hand playing the root of the chord and then right hand playing the chord. So you can do... on four times okay and then the next part of the song is the pre-chorus the same rhythm and for the pre-chorus basically you're going to be following these chords F minor B flat major 
F minor and B flat major. These chords work also the same way for the chorus where you sing mad world. Mad world. Mad world. Right? The same chords and then you go the intro or the, the hook. The same thing. Na, 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 na. So the only place where the chords are not F minor, B flat major, toggle is in your verse, which I just showed you. Okay. So the pre chorus is. Right. And whenever you go mad world, whenever it comes to the chorus, you can overlay the tune in the right hand with the chords in the left hand. So what we do there is we need to play that same <clears throat> right hand, left hand, right hand thing with only the left hand because the right hand will have to play the tune, right? Mad world. And then you play the tune. play that again only the right hand line one I've written it down here so you have so that's E flat C G A flat F G E flat D B flat but this B flat would already come with the left hand I'll show you right Repeat that again. And I've also marked out the second line's starting note, A flat, which you guys need to play at the off beat. So you go. So that needs to be at the off beat. So that's pretty much the song guys. So you have basically two sections, the verse where you go F minor, A flat major, E flat major, B flat major. Then in the chorus you're doing Mad World which is just F minor, B flat major and wherever you have to you, have, you overlay the chords of the chorus with the tune. And the entire songs on F Dorian, which is a really cool scale or mode, as we call it, derived from the E flat major. So I hope you guys have some fun playing this song. It's an amazing piece of music. Have a blast. Cheers.